Hi, my name is Thijs. I'm CTO and co-founder of uh, TreeShape. And I'm here to give you a short demo of our uh, new TRIA scanner, shortly to be introduced in the, in the US. Um, I'll just walk you through real quick here. Um, I'm going to create a new order. Uh, you, you select your lab up here from a list of labs that you're connected to. And really, it's, it's fairly simple, uh, a touchscreen environment. So you select the tooth that you want to scan uh, for prep. Let's say maybe a temporary here. And then you can even go in on the tooth itself and make some indications if you want to indicate something to the lab, let's say about colors. Uh, so you can do that really easily. Um, however, the most important, obviously, is the, is the scanning itself. And so I have the scanner here. We have the tip. It can go into the, the autoclave. Um, and uh, we can either point upwards, we use that typically for upper jaw scanning, uh, or, or downwards would be typically for lower jaw scanning. So I'm just going to go ahead here, uh, scan. Again, no powder, anything, so you can just, just directly go ahead. So I have here the, the lower jaw, you can take a quick look. It does get a little bit of the cheek here, that's not a problem. You can trim that away really easily. So uh, patch like this and like that. So then moving up to the, to the exit that was upper jaw, now moving to the lower jaw. And now for the bite, click over here. And for the bite, you just need a little bit. So it's as simple as that. For the bite, you don't need so much uh, data. You basically need a little bit of the upper jaw and the lower jaw. And then the software is going to automatically align it. So I guess I don't know how much that time was, but I think maybe 1 minute 20 seconds. About that, you have the full, full uh, uh, the scan from the quad up or lower and would be sufficient for a, a typical molar uh, situation. Now there's a few tools that I want to show you uh, where you can quickly analyze your scan. So obviously you can just move ahead and, and directly send it to the lab, but you can also do a quick analysis. Let's say you want to see the, the contact points of your scan. So then you can go ahead here and say clearance. You want to see the clearance from the prep. And you can turn on one jaw. So here you see the, the contacts and the clearance from the upper jaw. And you can even change the color map here to have different uh, clearance picture. You could also go in and say uh, direction here. And then it will show you the, the undercut. So if you have two preps or three preps, you can do come against, div against. Another nice feature is that, let's say on the upper jaw, that uh, you, you had a prep. Now I, I don't have any preps really here. But if you want to go back and rescan, or you want to uh, uh, prep more and then scan again, it's very simple. You go back, click on the upper jaw, oops, upper jaw here, like this, and then you can take away. Uh, uh, basically, you trim away here like a part of the prep. Let's say it was the prep, and then you want to obviously then you prep a little bit more on the patient, and then you want to come in and and do a little bit scanning from there. So then you can easily go back. And then directly fill in again here. So you don't need to rescan the whole situation. Another thing is if you want more of the mandible area scanned, then you can easily do that. You just come back. So it literally scans any surface that comes in front of it, whether it's gold, silver, temp material, any material you put in front of the scanner, it will scan. And the nice thing here again is, as soon as you're finished scanning, you can send directly to the lab 
and the lab will receive it within minutes. There's no processing or anything. So it's as simple as this. You send the order and the lab would receive it within, I would say, two to three minutes, depending on the internet connection. So all in all, we, uh, we're very proud of this product and we're looking forward to introducing it over here.